Thanks for tuning in. Jim wants to know how to test fail safe on the Furious 215 by Wakira. It has not changed much over the last 5 years, so this is not new. But I will show you first how to set up a fixed ID and then a fail safe test. First, as a safety precaution, let's remove all the propellers. You will notice that your radio transmitter takes a while to bind to a receiver out of the box. To enable an instant bind, you will need to assign a fixed ID. This will allow for this specific radio transmitter to bind to a unique ID assigned to your receiver. Let's run a quick test. Arming. Air mode. Idling. Disarm. To sign a fixed ID, you go to the model tab. Scroll down to fixed ID way at the bottom. Select fixed ID. On. Accept the default numbers or assign any preferred numbers. And select run. Now to test the fixed ID, we power off. People alarm. We power on. You notice the instant bind is a lot faster. Next, we complete a fail safe test. The objective is to stop the aircraft from flying any further than where you are when there's no radio signal and no autopilot present. Typically, you want to just stop the motors from spinning or descend gradually. Make sure air mode is off, no idling. Throttle up. Power off and observe the response. The motor stops immediately. Power on and resume control. This completes the fail safe test. You can further change your fail safe preferences within plane flight or the radio and receiver, but that will be your personal preferences. You can also change the safety switch and stick responses within deviation if you have that installed. Until then, have a good day. Hope you enjoy this episode. Still have to adjust uh, the idle on the high end. Yeah. Okay. You, you hear it, it just doesn't. It's flying really well, though. Yeah, it's very, um, very sluggish, like. Yeah. Front heavy. Woo. Super lever. Oh.